making our way down Italy and trying to get to Sicily. But I am currently located in Sarigerme, Turkey. Oh yes, a lot has happened. How exactly we ended up in Turkey? Well, that's a long story. But let's cut the story short. Basically, even though you may think that I have unlimited budget, that's not the truth. There was a monthly budget set for this trip. And as you know, we are a family of six that were supposed to go to, on this journey. So when we started the journey in Italy, I actually realized that it's gonna take a considerable amount of money to make it through. Uh, almost double what I was planning to spend. This fact, coupled with a couple more things like my solar panels breaking down totally yeah led me to decide to actually abandon the trip to Italy and I had to go back home that said uh, we went back home and two days after I set to a new trip to Turkey. It took me a while to get all things in order, but finally we're here in Sarigerme, Turkey, which is located uh, about 50 to 60 kilometers from Fethiye, and we are 300 kilometers from Izmir. We've been spending our time a week now in a nice little camp in Sarigerme. The actual more home is parked I don't know, 100 meters from the beach, I'm able to see the beach, so the actual location is awesome. The price of the camp? You won't believe it. It's six euros per night. It's absolutely crazy considering how close to the water it is, and I'm also getting electricity. We do have showers, they're cold, but they're okay, and we also have toilets. So everything seems perfect, right? Well things are for the most part perfect there are a couple of things first of all um, I didn't even knew that but the past couple of days in the past week there is a huge Muslim celebration um, congrats to everybody that are celebrating but that caused the camp to be packed full with people so it's really really crowded and that coupled with only having two toilets and two showers can cause a bit of problems but enough talking about the past what happened happened we're here in Turkey we are here in Sarigerme and today we're not gonna talk about problems we're gonna go through the little village of Sarigerme and I'm gonna give you a tour uh, this village is specifically made for tourists so if you're thinking about shopping don't do it but even if not shopping it's really nice to take a walk and have a bit of fun and try to avoid the quadruple prices just because of the tourists this is it so we had a short walk from the actual camp so the actual village is located about a kilometer from the camp and right now I'm approaching the entrance and as you see everything is looking really awesome which absolutely tells you that this is a tourist location and you're probably going to get ripped off if you go by there is actually one place in Sarigerme where the prices are not blown out of proportion and that's their local chain of supermarkets called Migros so that's my only recommendation as far as shopping goes here. On the actual entrance to the village, you'll find all the money spitting machines. So if you have money on the cart, they're gonna give you all the cash you need. And if by any means you've forgotten to do your teeth before you go to vacation, we got you covered. A dentist place, feast your eyes on all kinds of products. Uh, everything is original, 100%. Hello. Oh, what a nice t-shirt you have. Thanks. Could you tell me what this is? This is a custom piece, I guess. Yes, this is a custom one. It's Rain World. Rain World? Your yes. favorite game? Yes. And who made it to you? Uh, my aunt. Your aunt? Yes. Wow, what a nice piece. Yeah. We now pretty much reach the end of the road, so... The beginning down there... I don't know, maybe... 400 meters or so 
And that's the other drawback of this place. Uh, in Sari Girma, this is the only place you can go by foot nearby. So if you need something more, the nearest one is by bus and it's about 12 kilometers away or 45 minutes. And as soon as you pass the center of things, of happenings, it gets really, really nice and silent. Awesome. I don't know if you can see on the hill, there are some, I don't know, it seems like vacation homes that were built. Well, the thing is so steep, I don't even know how you get up there. Probably some crazy steep road up there. I don't think I would ever go for something like that. We found a little shop here in Sarigirme that makes handmade bags. And they're looking absolutely awesome. Such a nice designs. Let's go inside and take a look. Hello. Hello. Welcome. I got permission to film. Yes, 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 sir. So we, we, you, you, I was fascinated by the box. They are looking awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. This all stuff we do together with my husband. I think he's outside, yes? Yes, yes, I saw him outside and he said, take a look and I had to go in because it's looking really colorful and really awesome. I'm nice to hear you. Thank you so much. And everything is absolutely handmade and you can see that. So we actually wasn't able to walk out of the little handmade shop without buying something. My mom bought a really nice hand, handbag, school bag for my brother's daughter. So we are just waiting now 15 minutes, about 15 minutes, because they're also doing a custom tag with your name on the bag. So we'll see in a bit how it's gonna look like. It's absolutely awesome. I'm always excited when I see handmade stuff. And especially handmade stuff that it's not overpriced. Okay, here we go. We got our bag with a custom tag. And let me show you. I mean, it's really awesome. Look at the, at the design, even the actual, the actual... Just look how awesome this bag looks like. And behind you have the straps and then here is the actual custom tag with the name Ariadne. This is the girl that's gonna get this present. I absolutely recommend the people, they're really nice and awesome and guys they even gave us a couple of, yeah, a couple of like purses this. for my sons and they gave us those for free. Look at this. Look how nice they look. Yeah, I like the blue. Absolute recommendation. If you ever find yourself in Sari Girme, don't forget to go by the shop and buy your own little handmade custom bug.